everyone. Thanks for coming by today. I know it seems like I'm putting up a lot of videos, but I wanted to get this one up right away because it's the new Birchbox Starter Pack that was on Customer Appreciation Day. They launched it. I think it's actually sold out, but since I went ahead and got it, I thought I'd show you what was in it. So let's get in here and see what we've got. It, I ordered it because not only is it loads and loads of makeup to try, but it's also it comes in the cutest little tackle box. And I've noticed since I've started getting all of these makeups that, oh my goodness, I need somewhere to keep them. Oh, he's cute. Cute little pack. Lunchbox, start back. It's like the old caboodles. Do you remember the caboodles back in the day? It's like one of those. So cute. Little handle. This is gonna be oh, gonna be perfect for keeping my makeup set. Chock full of goodies, exciting. Oh, nicely laid out. Okay, let's see what we've got in here. I'm just gonna run through these really quickly. I'm gonna ask that you know I'm getting so many samples. I'm never sure what to try first. I have sensitive skin, so I'm slow rolling it with a lot of the creams and that kind of thing. So if something breaks me out, I'll know that it wasn't one of three new things I used that day. So if you've tried any of these and you're like, you should definitely try that first please comment below and I will for sure check it out. Thanks. Glasses time. Let's see what we've got. Hydrating collagen eye pads. How cute. This is the MAC strobe cream. Very cute. I think they said there were 19 products in here. It was $39. They said it was $159 worth of product. Smashbox photo finish. I'm going to admit this is not the photo finish that they showed in the packaging of it. They showed the trial size one. <clears throat> it's okay. I'm all right. Oh, LOC. Love Tati's LOC. Pretty. It's really dark, but I can probably try and smoke my eyes out with it. So that's kind of fun. And Stila, the Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliners. Admittedly, I'm not great with liquid eyeliners. I use the Laura Mercier Tight Line with a brush, and that just gives me a little bit of darkness. But I have such a small lid that I can't go with the... Okay. Marcel Mascara. Very cool. Years ago, I tried a Marcel eye makeup remover, and it was one of my favorite ever. Arrow Boost Color Enhancing Lip Balm. That's definitely a full size and that can go on my purse and will be great with fall and winter coming. A Real Chemistry Face Peel. Fun and exciting things to try. Always scared of face peels, not gonna lie. Scares me. Australian Pink Clay Sand and Sky uh, Pore Refining Mask. So lots of masks. This is a good time of year for that. I have the R & Co uh, Blowout Balm, always a good thing. I got a new um, balm in one of my other kits that I just tried last night, the number four smoothing balm. And my hair's a little flat today, but it feels super soft. So I think probably just finding the right amount that I need to use. Uh, Air Repair Moisturizer. I think I already have one of these, so it can be a pass along. My lighting is not great today, sorry about that. The uh, Mika Soul Food Nourishing Mask. For hair that will be great the oreb super shine moisturizing cream lots of creams to try on my hair i have super fine thin hair so this is new for me trying to decide to put creams and balms on my hair this is the cleanse and polish hot cloth cleanser they talk about this on birchbox a lot with using this and using it with this and they also say that the it comes with a muslin towel and that's also great to take off uh, masks with so I'm kind of anxious to try that came with a nice lash curler which I do have to use because I have absolutely no lashes but I have an old shoe Yamura one that I love diary of a beauty junkie oh it's the Smith and Colt the tainted lip stained flat let's see let's see what color we got in there real quick feel like I'm trying to fly through this because there's so many products and I hate putting up those 15 minutes of videos that are just product after product after product. Ooh, how very pretty this is. Very nice. Very 
very pretty. I like that a lot. A lot of the colors this fall tend to be leaning towards the peaches, so that's interesting. Oh, number four. This is the Super Comb Prep and Protect. This is the brand of the balm that I tried on my hair today. Yeah, Whey Wave Spray. Anxious to try that. I've tried the Whey Volumizing Spray and had a lot of luck with that. Wave Spray. Um, I kind of have it straight here, but we'll put a lot in there and we'll see what happens. And last but not least, the Visanti Brighten Up Enzymatic Face Rejuvenator. Good use of rejuvenating. Very cool. This is another good size. So, $39. We'll see. I got a full size balm, a curler. Uh, the Smith & Colt lip is probably full size. But then there's several other things. You saw. There's, it seems like it. Okay, way too many products for me to go ahead and list again. You guys just saw me do them. You don't want to see me do it again, so I'll list them below. Again, if you've tried any that you've had good or bad luck with, please let me know so I know what to try sooner than later. I'm just thrilled that it came with this cute little box that I now have to put all of my little goodies in. And this was the Birchbox Starter Pack. Thanks for coming by again, guys. Bye.